What's going on guys, this is Mike, and uh, this is a pretty awesome high scoring KD gameplay, and uh, I'm using the AK-47, and I kind of changed it around a little bit, I'm using Flak Jacket, Slack Van and Marathon, I usually run uh, the Scavenger or Hardline, but I don't know, I just felt like changing it around, and uh, this gameplay is, is a high scoring KDR gameplay, this is actually a really nice spawn nade, I actually don't get anyone this time, but uh, I've picked up quite a few triples and quads doing that nade, and it lands right in the window, it's pretty awesome. But um, I want to ask you guys a genuine question. What do you want to see from me? And uh, what, when I meet, when I say that, I mean, would you rather see me posting, you know, 120 to 10s using this combination, which is the chopper gunner and gunship, or would you rather me p be posting stuff like the AT and fives, uh, where I run a UAV, blackbird, and dogs, or something? So like, you can see more along the lines of a gun skill and not as much choppers, because I don't know, I had a little like. I'll say a debate, <laughs> oh, yeah I'll say a debate, I had a little debate in the comments on the last video uh, about the game 360, now I've got nothing against the guy, I've listened to his videos, I, he seems like a nice guy but um, I've I've watched about 5 of his videos and uh, 4 of them he was using the chopper gunner and gunship so uh, I thought it's, it, it's good gameplay but it's just a little bit, the chopper and gunship combination I don't particularly find that enjoyable to watch uh, so I want to ask you guys a genuine question now that's just my opinion and you guys are the viewers obviously you're the most important people on this channel so I just want to ask you guys a genuine question would you rather see you know me using the chopper gunner gunship combination where every gameplay I'm posting up is like 17 and ones 18 and ones 120 to tens because I, or would you rather see me using stuff like the UAV blackbird and dogs or the UAV Napalm and Blackbird or you know along those lines so you get to see gun skill pretty much throughout the game uh, If you could put it in the comments below I'll be really appreciated because I can do both or, or would you just rather have a mixture I can pretty much do that as well um, I'll just <laughs> I'll try and make the videos like the best of the ability because these videos would probably get more views And that's just because of the title of the videos and obviously the scoreline of the videos however I don't know if it's actually enjoy as enjoyable to watch. So, uh, yeah, I'd be interested in hearing your opinions. I'm gonna, but uh, as you can see, I've just got the first gunship this game. A uh, gunship. Everyone says I pronounce gunship like goonship or something. <laughs> I thought I pronounced it fine. <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> Everyone always um, says something about my accent or the way I, uh, you know, pronounce words or whatever. But fuck you. That's the way I talk. <laughs> Leave me alone. Uh, so I've just pretty much summed up what I really wanted to talk about. I didn't. I haven't done a commentary in the last couple of days just because I haven't uh, particularly felt in the mood to do one. Sometimes, you know, you get midway through a commentary and think, this is crap, you know, <laughs> this is boring, I don't want to release this video, no one's going to enjoy this, and so I just completely didn't do one. Sometimes I don't do one because people are in the house and it just feels really awkward, so uh, I'll try not to do one. But um, I just want to talk about something in particular, and uh, that is actually my uh, gaming history in uh, Black Ops, uh, not Black Ops, uh, you know, my gaming history, so, uh, the first actually console I actually ever had was probably a PS1, and if you're like 13 or whatever, you probably have never played one, so, uh, my first gaming console was PlayStation 1, I was a big fan of, like, the Crash Team Racing, Crash Team Racing, Crash Team Racing, uh, Crash Bash, Die Hard, all that, all them sort of games, and then, uh, obviously, the PS2 came out, and I got a PS2, and then on them games, I was playing stuff like the Gran Turismo, um, Formula 1. I was really into the racing games, and I actually never got into first-person shooters until Black Ops came out. Uh, no, sorry, not Black Ops. Um, Call of Duty came out. And uh, after PlayStation 2, I went on to Game Boy, and I was a really big fan of Pokemon, and I fucking love that game. I still love that game. Pokemon is fucking awesome. I love it. Even my background's Pokemon. <laughs> I've got a Pokemon background if you haven't seen it. So I just I, Honestly, I love Pokemon. I downloaded all the games <laughs> the other day onto my laptop, except for Pokemon Black, because I can't find a legitimate download for Pokemon Black. Fuck my life. Uh, so... Um, yeah, I just love Pokemon. <laughs> I played that for a few years. Uh, I played like Pokemon Red, Pokemon uh, Leaf Green, Pokemon Sapphire. Go into that, and then um, I went around my friend's house for one day, and he was playing on the PlayStation 3 on Call of Duty 4. And I said, you know, can I have a go? <laughs> and he gave me a go, and I, I just, I was shit. I've got to be serious. I remember playing COD 4 shipment uh, and getting a sh helicopter, and I was fucking ecstatic honestly and now you know I get a gunship or whatever I just remember, yeah great gunship <laughs> I was fucking ecstatic getting a chop uh, you know attack helicopter or whatever on them games and then I uh, managed to f talk my dad into buying me an Xbox and stuff so I uh, managed to buy the COD 4 series and then I obviously COD played COD 4 for quite a long time I think I've racked up like 30 days on that game now in the last four years or whatever and obviously then COD 5 came out 
fucking love zombies on that game, honestly. <laughs> Absolutely love zombies on COD 5. So I was really a huge fan of uh, COD 5. That's probably still one of my favourite Call of Duty is actually COD 5. I, I know people will disagree with me, but I absolutely love that game. And then uh, Modern Warfare 2 came out, and I thought I was a pretty good player on that game. Uh, so we decided to set up a competitive team. I uh, met some met a couple of people online, and um, yeah, a couple of my uh, friends from real life uh, decided to join a team. So we went competitive for a while. And then um, I decided to try and be successful and competitive so we made a four man team and we, uh, I think it was me, Matt's, uh, Jason and Alex and uh, fortunately we managed to get in the playoffs and if you don't know what the playoffs is it's just a bit like March Madness that you're watching now it's a bit like that and people put hours and hours into practicing and scrimming and uh, you know warming up the matches or whatever but we didn't do anything like that we just basically all came on at nine o'clock and just played the game and uh, God knows how, but we managed to actually get to the uh, semi-finals of the playoffs. Uh, for sh I think we got knocked out by Frico. Uh, I think it's Frico we got knocked out by, who was one of the top teams, top teams in Europe. So I didn't particularly was bothered about the loss. If you want to watch an old competitive video, I'll put the link in the description. Uh, it, there's no commentary over it. It's, it's just on my friend's channel. Who's um, you got? You can hear the callouts and etc. and how we play. So I'm in the game. So I'll put it in the description if you want to see that. Um, yeah, I think that's pretty much it. And then obviously Black Ops came out, and I started all this YouTube shit. So, yeah, I think that's pretty much it. I, I know it wasn't this commentary hasn't exactly been you know fun and entertaining or whatever, but uh, I just wanted to tell you because I know some people would be curious about all this kind of stuff. So I did play competitive. I want to play competitive in the future, but that was an 84 and one. If you could like the video, I'd be really grateful. And um, just have a nice day, guys. And I will uh, see you later. So uh, bye, guys.